That is totally awesome. It's about 120, maybe 121. Beautiful. Hundred and twenty degree heat. And that's just out of one. And when you're done, and that's it. Totally free heat. Once you get the solar panels, you're set. And again, it's 12 volt, so you can run them on a good sized battery, a couple of 100 watt solar panels, or uh, any 12 volt source that you have, as long as you can get the, uh, the amps. Again, they're individually controlled. They each have their own switch. So right now I got them both running, so it's 200 watts of power. But if you don't need that much, or you can just run this one and not this one. They're completely separate. It's awesome. All right, and as far as the build, it's ridiculously simple, so I'll just do a quick talk through. It's a two by three board and a three eighth inch square wood dowel. All I did was tack the dowel down to the board. I drilled two one sixteenth inch holes and nailed it down, and then two one sixteenth inch holes for these tiny screws to connect the heaters. These little plastic tabs are made at an angle so the heater will lean back perfect. Then all I did was drill the holes. In my case, the switches were about seven eighth inch in diameter, so I just drilled a seven eighth inch hole and then near the bottom of the hole, drill it out at about 3 8 inch so you have room for the wires. And that's it. Don't worry about the holes I drilled on the sides, that was just an experiment. Now I'll just show you the soldering, and then we'll hook it up to the solar panels and we're done. There's the start of it. Think of the brown wires right there as the red wire going out, and then we'll hook the actual red wires to the inner prong. So we'll put that on top now, and hook the red wires together and solder them on there. Then we're pretty much done. Then we just jam the switches in and hook up the solar panel. Set it up just like that. And let's do it. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Also remember to keep it straight like that so it'll fit right in. Don't put the wires at an angle. All right, now with the switches installed, all you do is connect the black and the red to one solar panel and the black and the red to another. Put them out in the sun and flip it on. Again, they're individually controlled, so you can run one or both. Left one. Right one. Or both. Sweet. Pushing 120. Might go beyond 120. Yep. Yeah. What is that? 121, 122? Basically 50 Celsius. Dang, that's great. The other panel's kind of at an angle to the sun, so it's not going to be the 120, it's going to be less, because less power. That's what I meant by angling of the panels. One of them's in full sun, one isn't.